This will help you track your car, a trailer, a toolbox, even your kids. Let's check it out. Dave Taylor here and I'm looking at this. This is the car lock portable and this small device actually is very cool. It lets you track anything that you put it in. So you can put this under a cushion in your trailer. You can put this in a car. You can put this in your toolbox at the work site because toolboxes keep vanishing and you can follow this with the associated app and find out where the heck that toolbox ended up. So this actually is an extension of Carlock's existing OBDI system. And I've reviewed this in the past. You could check out that review. But the earlier unit basically plugs into the onboard diagnostic interface in a car. And then it not only tracks the car's location, but it even gives you useful diagnostics like, you know, oil needs changing or there are some issues with your timing system or whatever. Whatever your car can generate, the car lock system can actually figure it out and tell you that information. This is a little bit more specialized, so it doesn't plug into anything. It's a completely self-contained unit with its own cell phone. I mean, somehow, somewhere in here is a 3G cellular communications device. And as you can see, dimensions wise, it's about five inches by four inches by two and a half inches. So it's not the tiniest thing, but still considering what it does, it's pretty amazing. It's 3.3 ounces. And like I said, you can monitor anything that you can slip this in including your kid's backpack not only that but there's a button on it that is the sos button so if your kid did have it in their backpack or your um, really wealthy client and they pushed the button and held it down for a couple of seconds you'd get an sos on your app and it would tell you where it is so that's really nice also includes real-time notifications oh here's one with my vehicle being moved right and then the app is for Android or iOS, and it's very easy to work with. You can get location. Here's an example of my location. And let me just talk for a second. So you see there's like that big green circle there, and that's a deliberate design. That is like the immediately adjacent zone. And you can just tell the system that, you know, within that zone, everything's fine. So if someone needs to move your car to get another car out of the parking lot or driveway, that's fine. But tap on that little lock icon and suddenly what happens is you're in lockdown mode and you will get notifications like the one we just saw that would say the vehicle has been started, the vehicle is moving and you'd be like, uh, what? That's not right. Um, so really nice, easy interface. You can tap on another one of the buttons and now you have your trip history log. Now imagine you run a fleet of cars and you have this in all the cars in your fleet. Or you have a teenager who says, I swear, dad, I go to school, I go to work, I come home. Then you can put this in their car. They're not going to notice this, right? And then you will be able to look at their trip history and say, you know, you don't just go to school and work because there's all these other places and all these other addresses. We really do need to talk. Not only that, but from a kid perspective, it also can actually keep track of how they drive. Oh. There you go. See, there's a harsh, harsh acceleration warning. You don't really want to get those. And that's not just for kids. That could be for your fleet, too. You might find out that one of your truck drivers is driving like they're in the Indy 500. And that's not good for what's in the truck or the truck or your insurance. So this could be great information to know. Now, let me tell you that this device does not last forever on a charge, but it's a pretty darn long battery life. It's five hours for a full charge, and then you get 14 days of use out of it. So that's pretty nice. Basically, the way I figure this is if every Sunday morning you collect them all and plug them all in, and then every Sunday night you put them back in all of the vehicles or trailers. Let's say you have an Airstream trailer and you're worried someone's going to take off with it. This is the perfect device for that. Just remember every seven to 10 days to give it a charge. Not only that, but you can get notifications in the app saying that the battery's low. So that's pretty easy. So only thing left to talk about is the price and the price is a little tricky because it comes with cell phone service. So this is actually not just a little device you buy once and you're good. It actually has a subscription fee. But before we get there, can I ask if you can go ahead and click on that subscribe button and instead of worrying about subscribing to this, subscribe to me. 
And then I'll tell you about how to subscribe to this. <laughs> cool. And feedback. Give me any feedback. I appreciate that. Now, Carlock Portable Advanced 3G GPS Tracker. The subscription fee for the unit is $9.60 a month or $113 a year. And you're thinking, wow, that's pretty steep. But in fact, it's really inexpensive compared to, for example, your trailer being ripped off or your expensive tools from the job site vanishing when you go to work one morning. How much did it cost for you to collect all those tools? Yeah, so 10 bucks a month is a pretty cheap insurance policy. It also has a base fee. So again, Carlock Portable, $99.95. You can pick it up at amazon.com and you can learn a lot more about it and check out the company at carlock.co. So this is Dave Taylor. I need to slip this back into my vehicle because I want to make sure I know where it is at all times. So I will catch you in my next video.